Available at JLD Auto Group is this 1934 Ford 3 window. However, upon a quick glance, you might be able to tell this is no ordinary Ford 3 window. This is essentially an entirely custom body and chassis hot rod in front of us. It's nicknamed the Jag Rod from the original builder, which was Ben Diener of Diener Built Corporation. Over $250,000 and 7,000 man hours went into this build. You might be wondering, well, what gives it its Jag Rod title? It's basically a morph of a hot rod and a Jaguar, as it features a 326 cubic inch V12 from a Jaguar, as well as Jaguar suspension componentry and Jaguar uh, inboard disc brakes. Also present are Jaguar gauges, which we'll see in a few moments on the interior, so some nice odes to Jaguar engineering there. Real 17-inch uh, Budnick knockoff wheels in a three-spoke design adorned exterior, and it's also worth noting that Basically, every body panel on the exterior is uh, custom made as the body has been channeled, sectioned, chopped, and widened. So, not a single panel has not been customized. Definitely gives it a very sleek look. And a keen eye might also notice that the rear features 1967 Pontiac Firebird taillights. Harbor Red adorns the exterior over a light almond interior with a, a match of cloth and leather surfaces throughout. Recaro seats are present, as well as a nice uh, black billet aluminum machined dashboard featuring those Jaguar gauges once again. Borg Warner T65 gear lever there uh, in the center console. Everything maintained in great condition. GM rack and pinion steering is present in this vehicle as well as modern comforts such as power uh, seats and other equipment where one would expect it. An electrically actuated uh, license plate as well as trunk lid are also present and can be actuated from the interior of the vehicle. So we'll get a look at the motion of these as it is power both ways for both of these instances of equipment and uh, especially with that retracting license plate can give it a nice sleek clean look especially when parking this hot rod at car shows. To make our way to the undercarriage here, we'll notice uh, it is very, very clean under here. Uh, you can get a good look at that custom full tube one and three quarter inch chassis, as well as uh, also the uh, other custom work under here, including the chrome uh, springs, as well as handcrafted suspension arms present in both the front and the rear of the vehicle. Once again, everything very clean under here. So that will uh, basically conclude the vehicle preview of the Jag Rod here. More details are available in our listing for this vehicle, but otherwise that is the Jag Rod and we get one last look there at that uh, custom electrically actuated license plate bracket there in the rear above the quad exhaust.